The morning dew has taken away most of our paint. Welcome to B&B Network, I'm Brandy, that's Ben, and this is our channel. Welcome to another episode of Converting a Bus into a Home. This week we are going to, uh, you're all blurry. This week we are going to be painting the roof um, so that we can start the like foundational stuff for the roof deck and the solar panels that we're going to be doing. So yeah. And of course we picked a very cold weekend to do it. So yay. First we got to get up on the roof and actually wash her down before we sand her so that we don't waste too many sandpaper strippy thingies. Well, if anyone's wondering, our sunroof held up very well. Uh, there doesn't seem to be any leakage or any water that was able to get in. There might be a slight problem with the lock, but uh, it still works and it looks beautiful. We're ready to paint. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. I know it's just the roof and we're only painting it white and everything, but it's so exciting! Um, ben, we got some like Rust-Oleum stuff, which is what Ben's opening right now. There is a few spots on the roof that have a little bit of rust, so we're going to cover those up with some Rust-Oleum. And then, for our big bad boy, this Elasto Cool 1000. Um, 1000. I know, right? It's some elastomeric roof coating, quite siliconized. So yeah, I'm pretty, I'm pretty excited about this. It's gonna be a lot, and it's the, we've got like three more hours of sunlight, maybe less. So let's get it done. So it is day one after painting the roof of the bus and the morning dew has taken away most of our paint and for anything that has still stuck, it's not dew, it's wet liquidified paint. I guess we're going to let it dry, but we're probably going to have to start somewhat from scratch. It literally did not rain at all last night, this is just the morning dew and like when we left yesterday. Almost all of it was completely dry, so I don't really know what we're going to do next time. <laughs> 